everyone, welcome to another vlog. So if you're watching this, happy Christmas to you. Um, we, I and my mom just arrived in San Francisco and we'll be spending about three days here. We're going to be in San Francisco the last day and then traveling around other parts of the Bay Area for the, for the next um, two days. So it should be really fun. We have a car so we're going to be driving around and doing some sightseeing. So today we're actually um, heading out from the airport right now and we're going to be heading up towards Marin County. We're going to stop at the lookout point to see the Golden Gate Bridge. Timberin County and we have to make a special stop for something that I've been craving and I mentioned to my mom when we were on the plane that I really wanted to eat this for lunch today and thankfully she agreed. And order of fries, anything to drink? We've secured the bag, the season's greetings, special holiday in and out bag. <laughs> These are the animal fries. Yum! And burgers. The other side so we can see the train. Mm. Oh, look at the cows! <laughs> <laughs> into our hotel we're staying in mountain view tonight at an a loft hotel so we just ordered uber eats because we were just really tired and got in late um it is like almost nine now and we ordered from azuma which is like um a sushi place so i ordered a like eel roll and then we have like a chidashi sushi rice bowl donburi rice bowl and then chicken um yakitori so we're going to eat this now. And after that, I think I'm going to go to sleep because I'm really tired. So I'll check in with you guys tomorrow. Hi, everyone. It is day two. It's Friday today. And um, we're just getting ready to check out of the hotel room. We were downstairs having um, breakfast this morning. I was doing a bit of work. And so now we're going to be heading up north today. We're going to some wineries that I'm really excited to check out. So I have my camera set on a light right now. But I'm wearing this new sweater that I got from... It's actually from a New Zealand based brand called um, Untouched Worlds, but I found it through a partner that I'm working with over on Instagram. This is not sponsored, but it's called Shop Celery. And so they like partner with um, brands, clothing brands that are have like sustainable practices. So yeah, I'm really excited to be discovering a new brand. I'm also wearing these pants, which are from Isto, which is um, a Portuguese sustainable brand that I learned about when I was there. And yeah, I wanted to do like all kind of head to toe white, which my mom just mentioned is actually not the best outfit to wear to a winery. So I'm gonna be really, really careful today not to spill red wine all over my clothes. Um, also have my boots on. These are the Bloodstone boots because it is very cold here right now in Palo Alto, but like San Francisco yesterday was kind of cold too, which I don't know why I expected it not to be because you know it is winter, so there's that. And I'm also wearing my trench coat, which is from Shop Sky, which is actually a San Francisco based brand. So I'm um, really happy to be wearing that here and it's gonna keep me nice and warm today. And the usual Kuyana handbag, cause it's nice and small and also big enough to hold my vlogging camera. Um, yeah, so. I'm taking a little break from my winter capsule wardrobe. And for this trip, I also decided to bring these back out. These are my Ray-Ban round sunglasses that I used to wear nonstop for like, a, I think like a couple years or however long that I've had them for. Um, but yeah, I have my other ones with me too, but I just thought it might be fun to wear a different pair while I'm here. So 
Really enjoying these again. Going onto the Bay Bridge right now in San Francisco. We're going to stop off at Treasure Island. It's a little detour. probably has some of the best like panoramic views of San Francisco. So there's the Bay Bridge behind me, there's all of San Francisco, and then the Golden Gate Bridge right here, and then this is like Marin County. And you can actually see a bridge in the background too, which I believe is, what was that bridge? San Rafael? San Rafael Bridge. And you can see Alcatraz, literally everything on Treasure Island. <laughs> Bridge, so we've just made it to the winery in Napa. It's very sunny out here. Um, this is called Artisa and it's actually more of like a modern winery. But you might recognize this place if you've seen the movie, I think it's called Wine Country. It was actually featured in that. So it could be interesting. Nice art. Nice. to Beyonce. Oh, is it this Beyonce winery? Very cute place. This is a spot that my parents have gone to a few times over the years and they really like it. And it's nice because it has a really pretty tasting room and then this lovely courtyard that overlooks a nice view. It is winter so it's quite brown right now but a really beautiful view. Very nice jazz music playing. Very relaxing. <laughs> We're doing a flight. There's my mom taking pictures. Little courtyard. This like is so dog cute. <laughs> Mom's on the picture taking. It is day three and I just wanted to quickly show you my outfit before we check out of our hotel. This is the hotel in Cupertino and yeah, I am wearing the same white jeans and boots from yesterday. I'm wearing my sleeveless sweater today, which is actually over another sweater because it's very cold. And then my trench coat, which is from Sky. Got my Kuyana bag, my mom's scarf that I've been wearing while I'm here. And yeah. Now we are going to check out and go get some coffee in Los Gatos. It's a little hotel bar, lobby area, cute little pool area out here. And now we are heading out.
we've just arrived at the Kimpton Enso, which is a lovely IHG hotel in Japantown in San Francisco, and it's really beautiful. We got here right as the sun is setting, so massive TV. So I thought I would just give you a little look around the hotel room. This is where we'll be staying for our last night here, and then tomorrow we are heading to the airport in the morning. So what a lovely place to stay. And look at this incredible view. I'll leave this hotel linked in the description box if you're interested in planning a visit to San Francisco. And then here is the bathroom, which is lovely. Cute little bathrooms. Now we are on our way for dinner in Japantown and we're also going to check out a gallery down the street as well. kind of tired. We ate dinner tonight at Yamada Ya, Yamada Ya Ramen. Um, they also do shabu shabu. There's nothing quite like eating a hot bowl of ramen noodles outside in the winter. So that one's very delicious. We both got vegan ramen with like a miso broth and asahi. And before we ate, we also went to Kino Kunia, which is a Japanese bookstore here in San Francisco and looked around there for a while. It was very busy. And we also went to see um, some photographs. It's um, an exhibit that was put together by a professor of mine, um, previous professor. So that was really nice and all right in the neighborhood. One thing I did forget to do this time around is I really wanted to go to the Cezanne pop-ups shop that they have in San Francisco and it's actually really close to us here in Japantown but um, I don't think we'll have time to go tomorrow because they open at like 11 so if you're in San Francisco um, and like anytime soon definitely check out the Cezanne pop-up. I went to one of their like permanent shops in London and it was really beautiful and what, from what I can tell from the photos it looks really nice here too. I'm going to get ready for sleep now because I'm very tired so I'll check in with you all tomorrow morning. everyone it is Sunday morning and we're leaving today um, I just got ready and it is so beautiful outside we're going to quickly jump downstairs to cafe mums for breakfast which I saw that they have like a traditional Japanese breakfast so that should be really good because I wanted to try that for a while but I thought I would quickly show you what I'm wearing today I have this Cezanne Louis sweater in black simple white crew neck underneath from colorful standard and then i decided that i was going to wear these pants again which means that i've only worn these pants pretty much the entire time i was traveling except for when i was on the plane i wear a pair of black pants so i'm quite proud of myself i did bring another pair of jeans but i decided to stick with this one so that i can say that i basically wore one pair of jeans for this whole trip which is more in line with my capsule wardrobe even though this was like kind of a special mini travel capsule and then i have my boots on I'm going to pop on my trench coat once again, Shop Sky trench coat. This has been the perfect coat jacket to wear on this trip for this weather. And then of course the Kiana mini system tote. So this is the outfit today for the airport. I honestly might just pack this after we come back from breakfast because I don't really like wearing the trench coat in the airport. It's a bit cumbersome. So yeah, but this is the outfit for this morning. 
such a nice day today. Just got back from breakfast which was delicious it was a traditional japanese style breakfast with like salmon and rice and miso soup and some like pickled daikon radish highly recommend cafe mums if you're in japan town at breakfast time um, and now we are getting ready to check out and head to the airport so i think i will finish this vlog here but um, if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more and leave a comment if you have any um, recommendations for our next trip to San Francisco. I'd love to hear them. Also, if you're watching this, um, Merry Christmas to you all and happy holidays. And thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.